What's up guys, this is Stu Katz Jr. with a commentary on King of the Hill Alpha. It's a game from a little little back, but this commentary is mainly for an apology for not many videos. I was gone f to, I went to my mom's for a little bit longer than I thought I would be. I left for the weekend, ended up staying throughout the week and then stayed almost through the entire next weekend. I came home on Sunday afternoonish around like two. So my dad was just kind of putting up little videos here and there just to make sure stuff was going up. But obviously I was not home to be able to do commentaries for you guys. All that good stuff. But I am now back. I am back I'm gaming settled in all that good stuff so hopefully we get some more commentaries out there for you guys since you guys seem to really like those but right now we are playing with our buddies Gary and Inferno which yesterday we found out that we probably won't be playing with Inferno as much due to the fact that he got on some other team or something he was saying but I'm sure that wouldn't work out he's not too much of a team player and I don't think they'll do too great in that but besides that while I was at my mom's this weekend a lot of stuff was going down like a lot of drama a lot of drama between me and one of my exes they're she was texting me and trying to like get back together with me and I didn't really want that at all so I was pretty much just trying to be nice about it and this was going on through pretty much the entire week and the first weekend I was there so she was always saying how she doesn't realize why we broke up she wants to get back together she thinks she can make it work and I'm being nice about it. I'm saying no, I, it doesn't feel right. La la la. I, I don't want it anymore. I'm over it. And then she starts going off on me, and she's all going crazy, just wake. Oh, I don't. If dudes out there w with relationship issues know exactly what I'm talking about, they should have just complaining about everything. They're, making up stuff oh it's your fault you're, you're you're controlled by your friends but pretty much what ended all that conversation was I was getting way aggravated towards the end of the week with her she was texting me 24 7 I'm just trying to enjoy myself have a good time while I'm here and she's just he just texting me make being a killjoy she's she was texting my mom trying to figure out if I was in town because she wanted to hang out. I didn't want to hang out. And I didn't want anything to do with her. I'm over her. I'm done with her. But she does not get it. So she was bugging me. And so eventually I told her to take a long walk on a short pier. Which I don't think she really appreciated that too much. But it needed to be done after that. She was dropping the F-bombs on me. All that good old stuff that girls do when they get mad so that was pretty much my weekend besides all the drama me and my friends had a pretty good time we were getting back into biking doing some BMX my buddy Matt built these like little homemade ramps and stuff out over in some little dirt lot really cool little area has some pretty gnarly little jumps and stuff pretty sketchy though since I haven't like ridden my BMX bike in like seven years I was all into skating and then they're all no we gotta go we gotta go get bikes now biking's a new thing so I went out I talked to my buddy that I gave my bike or my bike was just actually chilling in his garage so I talked to him he was like yeah I still got your bike don't worry here it is my dogs ate your seat so here's a seat so all right cool I got my prime bike back and I'm going and first day on the rollers like the little like bumpy things I don't know if anyone else out there like watches motocross or anything but I like the little like upsy daisy real quick ups and downs 
ate complete mad crap on it. Fell and just pretty much fell right on my back and like it hurt my back pretty good, but I mean it didn't really do anything too bad to me. So I'm still in the prime. Still prime time right now, everybody. No need to worry. But this weekend I don't really know how to explain it. It was kinda cool. I mean we had drama with our other friend and his relationship. Some girl was she was all antsy and mad because his buddy wanted to spend more time with us than her. So <laughs> I thought it was pretty funny myself. But she didn't. She was all crying about it and she's all oh I want to spend Valentine's Day with you and stuff. Like of course we they should but everyone's pretty much done with that girl at this point and we're pretty much blowing her off on every possible way ever like he's ditching her on Valentine's Day he's not responding to any of her texts all that good stuff to just make her mad and what else did I do this weekend let's see hmm well I met up with AJ the Ducky, actually. That was a pretty interesting, pretty interesting day. It was pretty much just normal stuff, just kicking it with homies, but it was fun. It was cool seeing her again and stuff. I don't really hang out with her that much. I mean, I'm rarely down there when I am down there. She's usually busy because she's just such a cool person, I guess. Something. Whatever she has to say to keep yourself motivated for something just joking but on the flip side actually just remind just just thought of this again one of my other friends got in a mad wreck mad car wreck so I mean, he's fine he did a bunch of damage he was he hit a car going 60 in the middle of the street he was a really moronic driver, just complete dip crap. He's grounded for a long time now, obviously, but yeah, he, he crashed into this like a uh, minivan type car, made it do like two 360s on all four wheels, made one of the girls inside the car throw up from fear, whatever you want to call it. I mean, everyone's fine. I th I'm pretty sure everyone's fine. I'm, I didn't hear anything yet. Like, um, like anyone got hurt. I mean, I think they're just really shooken up. But what I've noticed lately is this weekend, a girl, a woman, got hit, hit and run. She was killed. My friend got in a car wreck, and there was another car wreck right down the street. All I'm saying right now is like. A lot of people aren't paying attention to what they're doing. I think a lot of like kids my age are like, yeah, we're getting our licenses. Let's go, let's go freaking drive around, do stupid shit, let's go drift, blah, blah, blah. And don't do it. Don't be stupid. You could end up dead or really hurt. It's just, it's not worth it, really. Just have a good time. Do it safely, though. I mean, I have a good time. I'm, I'm, I am a good time, but... That's beside the point. We'll talk about that another day. But this has been Alpha on the slabs. We won. I got MVP. And thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and leave any comments of what you guys would like to see. Peace.